Highball Halloween is making its return to the short north. This elaborate event is one of the nation's biggest costume parties, and this year the party is for folks of all ages. NBC4's Anna Hoffman is there live now. Anna, how's the event going so far? Sierra, people are really starting to show up for this year's Highball Halloween, and they're all dressed their best. And as you said, it's the first time in two years that it's back at their home in the short north. And it's also the first time ever that Highball is having a family and pet friendly event in the afternoon. That kicked off today with at 2 o'clock with a kids costume contest, followed by a pets costume contest. Talk about adorable. And then tonight, as the sun goes down, the main event will begin featuring performances from local bands as well as the public costume contest sponsored by Goodwill. And this event is sponsored by NBC4. And our hosts are NBC4 Today anchors Matt Barnes, Monica Day, Andrea Henderson, and Matthew Herjack. Event or organizers say they've been prepping for the 15th annual High Ball for a whole year, and they're ready to get the show on the road. We're really excited to be doing this back in person as a street festival again. We've had to be on hiatus for the last couple of years due to the pandemic, um, and people are so excited to have this event back on the street. All of the proceeds made at today's event will benefit the Short North Alliance, and this event is just getting started. The band's getting ready to kick off, so you don't want to miss anything. Be sure to stay t tuned to NBC4 at 7 and 11 for everything you want to know about Highball Halloween. Local for you in the Short North, I'm Anna Hoffman, NBC4.